Welcome everyone to the Northwest Short Track Series race here at Myrtle Beach. The drivers will be on tap for 50 laps tonight. Uh, qualifying is just about to wrap up. There's about 25 seconds left. Um, looks like everyone put a lap time down except so for Ron Hunter. Uh, tonight we are going to have a full invert. So that means the guy that had fast time, he's going to be starting in the back of this 13 car field tonight. I uh, just finished up and then Casey Garber has fast time. So let's go and look at the standings right now. Uh, we got Casey Garber on the uh, first in points, followed by Josh Washington. Bobby Grady, Dan Lather, Troy Daggett, Eric Cheney, Dylan Huffines, Tyler Kim, Corey Eckelberger, and David Cannon. But we also got a note tonight that David Cannon and Dylan Huffines are not here. So these points could shake up a little bit now since they're not here. But let's go over your starting lineup tonight. Starting on the pole would be Ron Hunter. On outside of him is Terry Ackerman. Starting second row inside is Bryce Clark. On his outside is Chris Kamari. Third row inside is Dan Lather. On the outside of him is Troy Daggett. Fourth row inside is Corey Eckelberger. On the outside of him is Tyler Kim. Fifth row inside is Josh Beal. On the outside of him is Eric Cheney. Sixth row inside is Bobby Grady. On the outside of him is Josh Washington. And starting at the rear of the field, he is your fast time, Casey Garber. But the field's about to roll off in a couple seconds. Uh, Ron Hunter, you see right here, he's starting on the front row. He did not lay a qualifying lap. And in the driver's meeting, they said, if you don't play a lap down, you're going to start to tell of the field, so he's going to be getting an EOL here. And you'll see him drop into the back. So that would move up Bryce Clark to the pole position. You see him pulling in here on the inside, letting everyone go by. I'm going to follow the back. The lights are off the pace cars. One to go. See, like one car did not grid. That's the 15 of Chris Camaro. You see him in the pits. So he'll get to go once the green flag's out. They'll, let, they'll release him from the pits. Alright, they're coming down. Pace car's off. Green flag is out. They're going racing. Bryce Clark got a good jump. Terry Ackerman got a little tied up on that high side. You see Beal making it three wide now. Ooh, Ackerman and Daggett got into it. A little bit. Ackerman stays high now. But Clark is your leader, followed by Dan, Dan Lather. Lathers are going to try to get around Clark. He's on the inside of him. He's got the nose in there. And at the line, it's Lather. Here you got Casey Garber. He's already up to fifth from starting back in the last spot. Josh Washington's going to try to follow him up through you, but he also got Bobby Grady in third. He started towards the back also.
But your leader is Dan Lather. Looks like Josh Beals on the inside of him in the 37 car. It shows two on the ticker, but this car number is 37 here. Dan Lather got a little loose right there. Grady's up the track. That opens up the door for Clark. Garber's on the inside of Lather. Garber's up to second. Right now, your leader is Josh Beal. Followed by Dan Lather. Casey Garber. Garber just finally gets around Lather. You got the 73 of Corey on the outside of Clark. You make guy around him. Oh, you see Lather and Greg makes it. Dan Lather a little loose right there. He manages to save it. Bryce is up in the wall in the 98 car. Some great racing and battling going on right now. But Garber is working on Beal for that lead. He's got the inside going in the corner. Garber's around him. This is outside of Garber's car looking at Beal. Lowther and Gray are still side by side. Josh Washington is trying to find a way to get through. Got Chris Camary, he started in the pits. He's up to 12th now. He's going to work his way up. Grady finally gets around Lather. Washington gets around him too. 73 of Corey is going to try to get around him. Oh, there's 98th in the wall. You see Bryce Clark bounce it off the wall. But Lather's still holding on. We are 11 laps into this feature here. Tyler came. He got passed by Kamari. Ron Hunter's working on Daggett. This race is going to be a fuel mileage race. And they're going to need some cautions to help save some fuel, or they're going to have to try and save it as they drive. Hunter's inside Daggett. Clark is going in the pits. Hunter's around him. But Garber's still your leader. He's about a second lead over Josh Beal. Get Grady and Washington going at it. Eric Chaney's on the inside of Dan Lather. Washington, you see, got around uh, Grady in the one car there. And Eric Chaney got around uh, Dan Lather in the 63. Chris Kamari got around uh, Daggett. Terry Ackerman. Now, Corey, is the 73, is working on the 63. Corey Eckelberg gets around Lather, but Lather's trying to get back to him. The field has got strung out a little bit.
But your leader is still Casey Garber. He is your point shooter right now, and also he has the most wins on the season with eight. So he's been dominated in series this year. Looks like Ron Hunter is coming up on Dan Lather. Dan Lather must be trying to save his fuel. You see Daggett got underneath Chris Camary. They're side by side now. Looks like Daggett's trying to use uh Dan Lather has a pick there to get around Camary. They're kind of three, trying to go three wide right there. KC Garber here. This is outside Josh Beal's car looking at trying to get catch up to Garber. As you can see, this is sunset tonight for these drivers. You can see going in three and off of two, that sun is right in their eyes. This glare. They're trying to deal with that and hit their marks going in the corner there. Eric Cheney trying to run down Grady. But let's go through your field. We're halfway through. Your leader, KC Garber. Second is Josh Beal. Third is Josh Washington. Bobby Grady in fourth. Eric Cheney in fifth. Corey Eckelberger in sixth. Ron Hunter in seventh. Troy Daggett in eighth. Chris Camary in ninth. Dan Lather in tenth. Tyler Kim in eleventh. Terry Ackerman in twelfth. He's gone a lap down in this race. And 13th is Bryce Clark, and he's out of the race right now. But Beal is reeling in. KC Garber, can he get around him? Was the question with 20 laps to go. Now 19. They have gone green flag racing for 30 laps. But now you got Josh Washington trying to run him down too. He wants to get up in that mix. Go 
Gravity has fallen back a little bit. But right now, the battle right here for uh, six spot between Ron Hunter and Corey Eckelberg. Ron is trying to run him down. To get that spot. Dan Lowther is working on Chris Mary. Chris Mary got loose right there. Lather to the outside. Now Lather's a little loose off the corner. Now Chris got loose too. Trying to avoid. Chris is into the water right there. Lather's in the ninth spot now. He's going to set sights on Daggett. Trying to get him. Run him down. But Garber and Bill right here battling. We got Washington sneaking up in there. Coming up on 12, 11 to go. As I mentioned earlier, Casey Garber has the most wins with eight, but Josh Washington, who's second in points, has one win. Bobby Gray, that's who's in third in points. He has two wins. Dan Lather, fourth in points, has two wins. And Eric Ching, it's in six in points, has one win. And those have been your winners so far this year. Washington ducks on off into the pits. He must be out of gas. Like I said, these drivers had to save some gas. See him duck on off. Did anyone else save gas? Did the leaders, they've been running pretty fast. Garber's coming up on Kim and Kamari. You see Kamari got a little loose there. Tyler Kim's working on him. Got a good battle here for now fifth. Terry Ackerman still fading back. Josh Washington came is coming out of the pits right now, but he's three laps down from. Getting gas. We're at five to go now. Got a good battle here for fourth, fifth, and sixth. Now, Day is ducked into the pits. He must be out of gas. He's pitting from 7th spot. 
Now anyone else is going to have to pit. Your leaders, they've been running hard all night. Did they save gas? There's Josh Washington. Oh, looks like we got the one car, Bobby Gray, coming in. Get some gas. Here we are with Eric Cheney and Set Corey Eckerbutter and Ron Hunter. There's two to go. Garber's still your leader. He's gonna be coming with one to go. You let Washington go by, he must be on save mode right now. White flag is out. But here's your battle right here for Actually, he's now third, fourth, and fifth. Ron Hunter is setting up on the high side of the 73. Looks like Cheney slowed down. He, he ran out of gas now. He's coasting. Ron Hunter is becoming with one of his top fives of the year for third. And there's your battle there for... But your race winner is KC Garber. He probably doesn't have enough gas to do a burnout. He's pushing the 37, it looks like. Give him a push around. Oh. You see him there revving up his engine. He still has gas in the tank. So your finishing order is KC Garber first. Josh Bill second. Ron Hunter with a third place finish. Corey Elkeberg probably with his first top five of the year. Eric Chain fifth. Dan Wilder sixth. Seventh is Chris Camary. Eighth is Tyler Kim. Ninth is Terry Ackerman. He worked his way back up from being a lap down. Still a lap down, but to never never outside of pit. Troy Daggett is the tenth. Eleventh is Bobby Grady. Twelfth is Josh Washington. 13th is Bryce Clark. He finished 37 laps down. But don't forget, next week is championship night for these uh, Northwest Short Track Series drivers. They'll head to Concord for 99 laps at that little tricky uh, triangle, kind of, pretty much. So... Casey Garber probably expanded his lead over Josh Washington, which had a bad night finishing in 12th, and Garber winning. So Garber was already 40 points ahead of uh, Josh Washington. So he probably expanded more, so the championship's probably already been wrapped up with uh, Garber gaining more, because I think the max they can earn in a night is about 40, 45 points. So between all the finishing and, and all the bonus points they can get. So, but there is some other points battles throughout the the night, so so catch it next week for championship weekend for 99 laps at Concord. So they'll, they'll be fun. Thanks for watching. Have a great night.